morning everybody. Welcome back to another exciting day on the road with the Highway Maniac. I'm Emery West and I'll be your host today as we travel to Kingwood, Texas to try out one of the famous food trucks located around the Houston area. I want to take time to do a special thank you to all of you who subscribe and to all of our viewers as well who've taken time to watch our videos. Really appreciate it. Thanks for all your help. And believe it or not, all your views and all your subscribes really matter. So please keep it up. I'll keep trying to do a good video. You keep trying to watch. I know it's difficult, but thank you very much from the deepest of our hearts. Kelly and I really appreciate all you're doing for us. With that said, let's get moving along. So today we're gonna go visit a food truck called the Taste of Greek. It's down in Kingwood. So right now it's about in the mid 80s and it's, it's supposed to be 95 degrees out this afternoon as we're out riding around. Um, it's kind of overcast here. We had rain last night. So kind of hoping that as we take a ride before we get ready to have lunch today, the skies will clear up. We're gonna have a beautiful day for a great lunch. So I also wanna to add to you all is, I know you're watching these and I know they're time consuming, but I'm gonna ask all of you, my viewers, if there's something you want to see, I want you to let me know. So one of my viewers, Arthur, back in Bangor, Maine, he sent me a request to go see the Tulip Festival. And if we're still here, when that comes around in January or February next year, we're gonna go do the Tulip Festival. So all of you out there that's traveled all over this country, in this world, if you have something you want to see again, or if you just haven't seen it and you want to see it, you send me a message, let me know, and I will do my best over these coming years to video it and get it online and notif notify you that it's going to happen. Thanks again for watching, and come along and enjoy today's ride. So today we've come down to Kingwood. We're down on North Park Drive. We've come down to do one of the restaurant trucks. It's actually a trailer. We're gonna do the Taste of Greek today. Let's go up and see what he has and meet this gentleman. Morning, how are you? Good, how are you, buddy? No bad, bad. You don't mind being on film, do you? No problem. My buddy. name's Emery West. Alton. Nice to meet you, nice Alton. Nice to meet you too, buddy. So, how come a food truck? I mean, that's where somebody gotta start from somewhere, right? Absolutely. Yep. So, the reason we're here today is about a month and a half ago, maybe two months ago, we came down, we had lunch. It was phenomenal. I had a Euro, it was just absolutely delicious. So today we're gonna, I don't know what Kelly's gonna try, but we'll see what she's gonna have. I'm probably gonna have another Euro. I'm gonna try a Spanish Okay. And So have a good look at the menu here. Try to get a a little bit of a close up. I'm gonna have a euro. Okay, one euro. Euro, so uh, I'm gonna, uh, what do you recommend? Lamb? lamb? lamb Absolutely, yes, good, sir. good, I love lamb. What, what is, is what is this? It's a cheese, tiropita, feta cheese. Tiropita. Oh, let's try one of those, yes. how about that? Okay. Here's the drink list that he has. Excellent. So he's told us it'll be five to six minutes. The food last time we here was phenomenal. And as you all know, I love Greek food. I especially love Euros. So this is a small little place. Let me just have, kind of have a look around here so you can see what's here. Sometimes there's more of them, sometimes there's few. Today he, there's another one open as well. So let's just have a look. Kelly says don't get her in the video, but everybody says if we're gonna do this, she has to be in the videos. Absolutely, how long you been doing it? Uh, five years. Five years? Pretty sure. There you go. For all of you back in the Northeast that don't ever get to have an original Coca-Cola, here's one of the best things of being in the South, especially in Texas. You get to actually have a Coca-Cola that is made in Mexico. Check this out. Look at that. Old fashioned bottle. 
Absolutely, product of Mexico. They taste so much different than the ones from home. All right, so thanks to my sister Stephanie, I am no longer wearing glasses except for when we're riding because she told me that she didn't like the glare in the in glasses. So let's see what we got here. So, oh, look at that. It's a spinacopita and the cheese. So let's have a look at what that is. So this would be the spinacopita. This would be the I'll have to look it up because I can't remember it right now sitting here. So let's get a good look at this. Oh yeah. It's nice looking stuff that is right there is. We'll let her we'll let Kelly take a bite of it. This is filled full of cheese. And here's mine. Now so this is a lamb euro. Let's get this opened up here and have a good look. He does a marvelous job with this, by the way. So there's the sauce. It's the lamb shaved lamb meat. And we'll eat them nice fresh tomatoes right there. Good thick slices. There's some red onion in there as well. Oh yeah, that's going to be just delicious, I can tell. So let's dig into this, shall we? Oh yeah. Look at that. That's, that's probably close to, oh I'm guessing probably just under a half a pound if it isn't quite a full half pound of meat for the whole sandwich. So we'll wrap that up a little bit. Let's have a good bite into that, shall we? You like it? Oh yeah, I love it. Love next, it. Next year we'll move into the building. You're gonna move into a building? So you're gonna oh, brick and mortar next yes, year? Yes, sir. Awesome, that is great to hear. Kingwood Drive and the Wilson Houston. Kingwood Drive. All right, okay. Mmm. Oh no. Mmm. That's good stuff. Oh. Oh yeah. The lamb is tender. Have a little spice to it. Uh, the takari sauce. It's got a that, that dill bite, which is nice. It's not overpowering. Um, tomatoes are fresh. Onions are wonderful. So let's have another bite of this, and then we'll explore what Kelly's been into here. Hmm. 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 Yeah, wicked good food, wicked good. You have to love these food trucks that are around Texas. They do such an excellent job. I mean, you have to pick and choose, but you know, we'd been here before, and like I said, it, it, he does an excellent job with this, and I love a good Euro. Spinacopita, you can see that it's got a little cheese and a little spinach inside of there. That phyllo dough, let's have a bite of that. Oh, oh, yep. It's hot, real hot. It's good. Um, the cheese is a little thick for me, but it's really tastes it tastes well. It's got a nice flavor to it. Let's go back to this gyro. Oh, it is so good. So, have you been in this same spot for all same five years? Same spot for two and a half years. Two and a half years. Yeah. Excellent, excellent. Sitting outside. And you all know by now I love to sit outside. So, you get to sit outside, it's about 95 degrees here today. I mean, it's just wonderful. You know, the, the noise of the cars doesn't really bother you too much because the food is so good. It's nice, but as he said, he's gonna open a brick and mortar shortly. And we'll go back and I'll find out the true address of that for all of you. So, you're gonna do your brick and mortar store. Where are you gonna locate it? Uh, by the Rondos Kingwood Drive at Western Houston. Okay. Do you have the address at the moment? It's, uh... 4526 Kingwood Drive. Okay. Oh yeah, this is this is just lovely, I can tell you. You can tell that there's a passion to this, the way it's made, and the way that it tastes. You know, the sauce is all the way through it. The onions are just right, they're shaved thin, and those tomatoes are so fresh and ripe. Excellent. That's wicked good food. It's the taste of Greek down on North, North Clark Drive. Just an excellent job, excellent job. So, Kelly is bitten into the other piece, which is phyllo dough and cheese without spinach. You can see how flaky 
I mean, just look at the flake, the flake on this, how it just flakes right off. The phyllo dough is done perfectly. You can see where he cooks them individually in a pan. Let's have a taste of this, shall we? Mmm. Mmm. That's good. The cheese is not too soft. It's kind of stiff. The phyllo dough is cooked just right. Excellent. Excellent. Not much of a meal as far as I'm concerned for her, but I guess. That is so good. Okay, so Kelly informs me that I enunciated the sauce incorrectly. It's called tzatziki sauce. I apologize to all of those out there. So, we're down to the last bite. As you can see, the sauce is just mel melded all around this. There's true passion and love in this sandwich. And we shouldn't call this a sandwich because it's a gyro. It's just heavenly to eat. Truly good. The taste of Greek on North Park. So before I take this last bite, I want you to know the tomatoes here, the tomatoes are so fresh and they're so soft. They're unbelievable. Their flavor just totally goes wicked good food. And can you give me the, uh, how much longer are you going to be here? Uh, probably next year sometime January, February. Okay, do you have the, can you give me the address to this? This is uh, 1956 North Park. Excellent. I'll make sure it's on, put it on the bottom of the thing. Do you by, guys have by, a face? By the Kenneth's uh, card here. Okay, do you guys have a Facebook and stuff? You got the card over there. I got, got the card. Yes, sir. I'll make sure you get a, I'll make sure you get a notice before I put it on. Appreciate it, brother. How's that? Thank uh, you thanks, very much. Man. Thank you, man. Excellent food, by the way. Great Thank job. You. Well, this brings us to the close of another great day of eating good burgers and good food around Houston, Texas. So we're back home in the dooryard here. I hope you've enjoyed sharing our experiences today with us, and I hope you'll continue sharing them as we continue traveling this great country. If you haven't clicked on the subscribe button down below, click on that red button, and don't forget to click the bell so you get notified when a new video comes out. Look below for Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and Pinterest links so you can follow us through our daily travels. Again, thank you from the Highway Maniac. And remember, when in doubt, take it out and ride it out.